Hello, Hitman fans! To complete the challenge Kickback Kimono, you have to lie down in all morgue tables and 47's bed while wearing the VIP Patient Kimono. The VIP Patient Kimono is the default disguise with which you start the Situs Inversus mission in Hokkaido. After the completion of the challenge, 47 will be able to wear the VIP Patient Kimono in other locations as well. Are you ready? Let's proceed. We get out of bed. And we lie back down on the bed. Your personal room has been outfitted with a radio frequency identity. Now we have to get to the morgue. There, 47 will lie down on four morgue tables. Follow me. Okay. Hope you have everything you need. We are in the medical staff sleeping quarters. I'll take the neurochip remote control. I'll use it to access the organ storage room later. After completing the challenge, I intend to eliminate the targets and complete the mission. Our first morgue table. The second table is outside the morgue, near the stairs leading to the operating theater. The third table is right behind the two talking doctors. Uh, does it work? Sorry, you're just gonna have to wait for my research paper. I'll wait here until the doctor facing 47 right now goes back near his colleague. I've got a very interesting bit of insight into his mental state. Fine, fine, I'll just have to ask you again when we're drunk. The fourth morgue table, and the last one of the challenge, is near the organ storage room. It's me. Are the... the challenge has been completed. Now go away. Unless you are a true Hitman fan. True Hitman fans may stay and watch the rest of the video. Final details in place. Dr. Ito, the curator, has a chip in his brain which is now activated. Now I'll run to the security room to disable the surveillance system. The curator is in charge of the organ storage room. He can go inside it anytime he wants. And he wants to do so when he is happy. The chip inside his brain can induce a state of euphoria when activated. The chip was just activated, which means the curator is now happy, which means he will soon go inside the organ storage room. Once inside, he will dismiss the two bodyguards who are watching Mr. Soldier's replacement heart. That is the right side right. of Zona Heart destined for sodas. I need some time this is what he sold out the ICA My for. Babies. Come back later. The curator will get out of the organ storage room if he is depressed. Oh, not cloud bank rolling in. Oh, how, how did I imagine I could escape? Oh, this is who I am. Always will be. We go in and destroy Eric Soder's replacement heart. Now I have to run after the curator and make him happy again. If he is sad for too long, he is going to commit suicide. I can hear some of you thinking, ah, uh, he is not a cold-hearted son of a bitch after all. He cares about Dr. Ito. He doesn't want him to get hurt. No, dumbass. The curator is a non-target. His death will compromise my silent assassin rating. I have to run after him and make him happy so that he doesn't jump off a cliff and ruin my gameplay. So far, so good. Time to take care of Miss Yamazaki. We go to the sauna. Oh. 
Yuki Yamazaki does not use the sauna because the temperature is too low and there are people inside. We increase the temperature. The people currently inside the sauna are pussies and they cannot take it. They will leave. Next time Miss Yamazaki comes to the spa, she will find that the sauna is hot and empty. Just like she likes it. After she goes inside, we lock the door behind her. She will die. We exfiltrate. The end. That is Yuki Yamazaki, former lawyer to the Yakuza and current operative for Providence. She is followed by a bodyguard, but the bodyguard will leave. I'll exfiltrate riding a snowmobile. Now I say goodbye. And until next time, don't forget to have fun.